Our first guest is the hilarious, lovable, sex-crazed Ukrainian cook on the hit CBS comedy, Two Broke Girls. And you know what? He also is the star on Adult Swim's Black Dynamite. Yeah. Here to talk about the new season of both of those shows is actor Jonathan Kite. Welcome to Arise 360. Thank you so much for having me. Okay, right. so you're not Ukrainian. I am not <laughs> Ukrainian. I've been had. I came on the show to let out a secret. I'm not Ukrainian. <laughs> uh, it's just a shame. No, I, um, my, I, my father is from uh, Eastern Europe and okay. my mother is Scandinavian. Really? So, but I play one on TV. So how'd you perfect this Ukrainian accent? I'm from the Chicagoland area and there's a lot of Eastern Europeans that are, that, so a lot of my friends growing up are first generation Americans. Mm -hmm. And so just by mimicking their parents growing up, just being in the kitchen and hearing them go, Alex, come on, we have to do this. We have to, <laughs> we have to get, like there was this kid, he's gonna kill me for saying this, uh -oh. who used Say to it. sell old, <laughs> like used toothbrushes. This is a true, uh -huh. on the playground, and I remember, he, I think he like got them maybe from his parents, and he was like, we're going to try to sell these. I'm like, eh, I don't think anyone's gonna buy used toothbrushes, but at the end of the day, he didn't have any. So I was like, man, no, he sold them all. Somebody so, bought them. Somebody okay. bought them. Oh, somebody right. bought them, as long as they're not stealing them. Again, I didn't buy them. Don't steal them from drugstores. We don't condone any stealing of any kind. Don't rob banks. Don't do any of that, right? You guys had my, my old Twitter handle was Maybe She's Ashy. Oh. At Maybe She's Ashy was my old Twitter handle. That makes so a lot of sense. It's crazy that you brought that up. It's yeah. serendipitous that I'm here today. It makes sense. You, got, you two are a mess. Can You're we so take much. a kind of clip of the show and then discuss further, shall yeah. we, gentlemen? Shall we? We okay. shall. Okay, let's do it. So I tracked down this original tenant guy, Lester. He's still alive. Ugh, can't catch a break. <laughs> He's at a rest home in Sheep's Head Bay. We just have to go there and kidnap him. We'll tie some cream of wheat to a pole and lure him out. <laughs> First of all, in what world do we have cream of wheat pole money? <laughs> and secondly, I'm not gonna go shake down some old man. You won't have to. He's probably already shaking. <laughs> If you're looking, I know a place. You share a twin bed with two other girls. Oh, and there are cameras. But you're paid $4.99 a minute and get to meet all the singles in your area. Are you one of the singles in the area? Technically, I'd be your co-star. <laughs> he is hilarious. So Give besides you, you, I know, bad boy. You have to do that after every show, though, because he's don't a bad you boy know, on every you show. Don't spank Oleg. No, <laughs> ever. Although he would like it, though. Like yeah, that's that. what I'm saying. <laughs> Not to punish. Uh, I love that. That shirt is one of my favorites, so I wear a lot of netting, and it looks like a fisherman caught something and then, <laughs> they, and then threw it back, but he got in the net. <gasps> that is hilarious. Now, you're not only funny on this show, but you also play several characters on Black Dynamite. How many people yeah. do you play exactly? I don't know. I haven't, I haven't counted. Uh, we have a joke, uh, the, the producer and I, 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 I say that when they, uh, they need like a, like a random impression from the 70s, because mm -hmm. you know a lot of people don't do the older impressions, mm -hmm. but the show takes place in the 70s, mm -hmm. so like Sean Connery, Roger Moore, but um, I don't know how many I've done. But yeah, the second season is starting up, and it is it's hilarious. I think people who love the first season are going to love this one even more. Really? <laughs> yeah, it's huh. really good, so really good. You, what were your early days like in your career? I mean, clearly you're not broke now, but uh, what were the, the lean years like? The, no, the, the lean years were I was working at a restaurant in Los Angeles, mm -hmm. and um, I had just moved out from the Chicagoland area. Mm -hmm. And I was living in an apartment with two of my best friends, and we were we were a sitcom. We were three guys trying to make it, and um, it was that was actually like that for a long time. Mm. Probably, yeah. I mean, I've been out there for about ten years, and it was it was like that for a, a lot of the maybe like the first six or seven years. Right. And I've heard that you actually are an expert <laughs> impersonator, and you do like over a hundred celebrity impersonations. I can do a lot of celebrity impressions, okay, which I give us your three best. Uh, let's see. Three best, right? Yeah. I'll do. This is uh, Seth Rogen. Okay. I, uh, <laughs> I, uh, I will not remember this interview tomorrow because I am so stoned. <laughs> <laughs> I love the laugh. That's actually pretty good. Um, Tom Hanks. Uh huh. Hi, hi. I'm America's favorite actor, Tom Hanks. I play Woody in Toy Story. <laughs> that's that's really awesome. Good. Thank you. You mentioned Sean Connery. Can you do Sean Connery? Can I do Vince Vaughn? Because that's my favorite. Okay, okay. yeah, favorite. Vince Vaughn. Hi, uh, I'm excited to be here. I kind of like the energy you're giving off right now. I like that smell on you. What is that? The uh, that's the mango. Ha! Ah, <laughs> Daddy liking the mango. Daddy liking the mango. <laughs> that is awesome. That is great. Thank you. So wow. what? 
<laughs> Other than making us laugh on these two shows, what's next for you? Um, I'm trying to put together an hour of stand-up special that I'm going to hopefully record in the next year or so. And just the show keeps me very busy. I mean, we shoot, you know, 24 episodes a year, so that's my primary job, and it's, you know, it's full-time. It's really busy. So I'm doing a lot of stand-up around the country. Okay. And, uh, yeah, pretty much my time's filled with those two things. Well, we'll definitely be checking you out on Two Broke Girls and Black Dynamite. Thank you so thank much you for Thank you so much for us. having me. It was thank a pleasure. You. Thank All you. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. And you're watching Arise Entertainment 360.